Yourself a crime statistic, it. tough guy. I'll cut your dick off, you fucking monkey! Sit back and enjoy the Do ride. Algonquin Dukes Expressway, please. Jill Van Krasenberg and them booty cutters. Here we are. It's a wrap. I'm here to see Mr. Gravelli. I was sent by a mutual friend. Come on. Uh, someone here to see you. Here. Oh, so you're the one who's getting involved with that nonsense for my dear friend James Pegorino. I don't know what Spare you're... Spare me, please. I'm an old man. I ain't got much time left. Our mutual friend told me everything. Thank you. It made me <laughs> <laughs> My pleasure. <laughs> people are so damn vain. Some people? <clears throat> All people. Even you, even me, an old man facing the end. And I still care. Care how I look. Care that when I shit myself, the pretty nurse has to clean it up. It's, it's ridiculous. Yeah, well, uh, you know... And I care about my legacy. I've worked hard for this, this line of work. Now some Russian assholes think they can march in and take control of rackets my family has run for 50 years. <laughs> you mean 50 years of you bleeding the city dry might finally <laughs> come to an end? <laughs> I know it's a terrible <laughs> tragedy. <laughs> <sighs> but if it wasn't me, it would just be someone else. So it might as well be me. Yes. Let me tell you, that faggot friend of yours, Bernie Crane, his boyfriend, he's being blackmailed by them damn Russians. They want him to put certain contracts up for tender. Windows, bus lines, cleaning, ones we control. These Russian fucking bastards are trying to finish us. What do you want me to do about it? I want you to work with me. In exchange for what? The police have a file on you an inch thick in exchange for that. In exchange for that guy you've been asking about being brought here from wherever it is he's hiding, Switzerland or some shit. <sighs> okay, good. What do you want me to do? A good friend of mine is coming into town to give a speech on the new threat to Liberty City. Russian organized crime. I got a feeling some people ain't gonna want that speech to happen. Maybe the guy you...
You guys waiting for me? Nico Bellic, right? Yeah, that's me. Stay in convoy with us all the way to City Hall. All right? Sure. to see you as soon as I've delivered the speech. Don't say that, John. You'll be feeling like a teenager again in no time. Those are the wonders of modern medicine. Oh, I'm gonna bring up everything we discussed. When I'm done at the podium, Mayor Ochoa is gonna be dedicating half his annual budget to cleaning this problem up. <laughs> he doesn't want to start getting reckless with the lives of Liberty City voters. No, John, if it's your problem, it's my problem as well. Take a deep breath, John. That's it. I'll talk to you later. Driver, why is this road closed? Is there a problem? Another roadblock? This definitely wasn't mentioned on the traffic report. I'm gonna go and move the barriers. Come on, Mr. Jefferson! Let's get out of here! wanting to kill you. How about that? Ha <laughs> ha! 
don't know who you are, but you got me here. Goes to show, some immigrants have the best interest of the country in their hearts. I'll tell John you did well. Mr. Grovelli, I took that friend of yours to city. To Algonquin Dukes Expressway, please. Here we are, then. Whoa, ah, Nico, good to see you. You too. How are you, Mr. Gravelli? Good, good. I was just speaking to our mutual friend about you. He said how efficient you were. I like that. Then he mentioned something about a Darko Brevich. What? He did? Yeah, he's located the guy. It seems he wasn't in Switzerland at all, but in Bucharest. He'll be here soon. Good, good. And it seems your Russian friends are getting the message. Some of them. Oh, okay, so... I think it's our turn to do a favor for that mutual friend of ours. Seems some Korean has come into the country and... and is selling money at a discount. You don't need me to tell you that it's all Fugazi. Faker than a pair of vinewood tits. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Listen, I need you to deal with this. Eliminate the guy. What he's doing is no good for the economy and no good for patriots like you and me. <laughs> so who is he? His name is Kim Young Guk. He'll be very well protected. He eats at Mr. Fook. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Mr. Gravelli, are you all right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm fine. Wait, 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 wait. What was I saying? Kim Young Gook, he eats at. Yeah, right. Right, right. He, he eats at a restaurant called Mr. Fook's Rice Box. Yeah, in Alderney City. <coughs> Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Go, Heffy.
Where is Kim? He's upstairs, speaking with the manager. They don't want to see nobody, though. Kim and I are old friends. Kim got a lot of money. He don't need no friends. Get lost! You have it exactly five... <laughs> I've got in my sight! You're going down, asshole! You must be on my side! There's nowhere to run! No, please! Ah! I give up! You are a good man! Fuck now, asshole! Take cover! Get my thing a little! No. Stupid, you're not going to live very long. Where's Kim? Uh, he heard you come. He ran out back through the kitchen. his last force.
Hey. Yeah, so, uh, anyway, a friend of mine in here tells me that a close friend of yours, a girl you've been spending a lot of time with recently, swept a clean off her feet. Okay. Yeah, her old boyfriend wants her back. They always do. Desperately and quickly, and he's looking for her. I think you and her should go out on a glamorous date in Algonquin. Show her a new pad. Then, things would be okay between you two. But move your fucking ass, pal. Women don't like a chump, you get me? You're moving up over to Bowling Street. Not in the cab of this car, I'm not. After last time, she can ride in the trunk. Fair enough. Ah, bitch just bit me. Oh, 
Daddy's gonna get you! Sorry, guys. We're keeping this bitch. Nico, my man. Katie's taking over on my duty, so I'll be watching this Guido bitch for you. Where is she? In the trunk. She don't play too nice up front. Gracie, Gracie, act nice now. You motherfuckers, I'll rip your cocks off! Help! Help me! Let me out of here! She's a wild one. I'll try to calm her down. Let me out! See you later, Nico. Oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you! I'll 